Alrighty. Ah, the conquering hero returns. And with hardly a scratch on him. I may have picked up one or two. Ah. <sighs> Well, the fact that you came straight to me instead of visiting our resident physica suggests that you picked up something more important. A scent. The scent of Weludas. The very same. For whatever plans Kupka was hatching with the Royalists, he took them to his grave, as did his men, slaughtered by the orcs who'd taken over the Fang. Orcs, Vivian. I've never seen such creatures in Storm before. The Waludas must have ferried them over from Ash, but why? Why work to rescue Kupka only to invade his home, the mother crystal of an allied nation, and let both fall? It makes no sense. Do you know the tale of the blind men and the Adamantus? One can often be led astray by focusing too closely on individual details. One must instead see the bigger picture. And what bigger picture is there than my map? The kingdom of Wulud claims dominion over all of Ash. It is a nation forged by the bloody conquest of Barnabas Tharm, the dominant of Odin. The Canvarian War of Independence in 849. The Battle of the Twin Realms in 865. The Battle of Belinus Tor in 873. Wheresoever his armies fought, Odin was found where the fighting was fiercest. But of late, the warrior king appears to have laid his sword to rest. Battle rages for control of the crystalline dominion. Yet Tharm sends not a single ship in support of his Dalmechian allies. Meanwhile, the blight ravages great swathes of ash. Yet warlike Walud shows not the faintest interest in laying claim to untouched lands. So why go to the trouble of sending an army of orcs into the heart oh of Drake's Fang? Only to make no attempt to claim the Mother Crystal for Wulud. It can hardly be for lack of men. Tharm's armies rival any in the Twins. No. We have not seen the last of the Wulud standard. Odin will ride again. It is but a question of when. And on that day, who will be trampled underfoot? In summary, I know not to what end the Royalist betrayed Kukka. I know only that it is part of some broader scheme. A scheme tied to the ambitions of one man. King Barnabas. But there is no need to wallow in confusion. If one is to cure a sickness, one must first identify the symptoms. And your Lord Uncle has volunteered to do just that by keeping an eye on the Royalists' movements. <laughs> He's really throwing himself into this. <laughs> Indeed he is. Which means all that remains for us to do is await his reports. Well, not quite all in your case. The people of the hideaway must hear the news. Justice has been done. Hugo Kupka is dead. The wounds he left that night are still raw. Especially for those who lived with Sid the longest. Tell them that those wounds might finally begin to heal. Consider it the price of today's instruction. I've never known you to be sentimental. <laughs> what can I say? I am only human. And we are... All of us, sentimental animals at heart. I suppose we are. Very well. I'll go and spread the word.
Sorry, I was looking at something. Ah, my favorite pupil. How may I help you today? Here's the latest information I have. Jeez. I cannot believe I cannot believe this woman somehow was able to make somehow was able to make her son the emperor that makes no sense like this is this is the most fishy thing I've ever seen in my life cheese very good also what is this I haven't checked this in a bit so I probably should fancy a look at the list do you Quick look. Okay, well, I mean, that's... Always something yeah, I think I'll there. probably do those off-stream. Like, I'll probably do side quests off-stream, I think, now. Yeah. Oh, I gotta go speak to people about the good news. That fucker is dead. Someone looks pleased with himself. It's true what I'm hearing, then. Nothing escapes you, Lady Karen. It's true. Kuka is dead. Hmm. No more looking over our shoulders, then. Good. I'm starting to get a crick in my neck. Don't let it go to your head, though. Roger that. Is it business or pleasure? It'd better I'll be here. You'll not find a better price than that. Why can I buy that much? Okay, no. Why can I buy that much? What? Since when was I able to buy so much of stock? That's too much. I should not be able to purchase that much. I don't even need that much, actually. I'm just wondering why I could purchase so much off like did you didn't used to be like that, I'm pretty sure. You're rubbing me blind, you know. Come again. Oh don't. I'm not much bothered either way. Blackthorn. Do you have a moment? What is it? I'm busy. I wanted to tell you that Hugo Kukra is dead.
Oh wait. What do you need? The same for you, dear. No scratches, right? Clive, have you come seeking the gift of knowledge? No. To share mine, actually. Hugo Kukur is dead. <laughs> oh, my. Can, can, can it really be true? <laughs> Look, he's crying. <laughs> he is. <laughs> Big baby. <laughs> and with good reason, children. These are tears of joy. We must offer up a prayer to your parents that the heavens might weep with us. There shall be no lessons today, only thanksgiving and merrymaking. Go, put away your things. All right. Brilliant. Finally, a new dawn has broken. It has. Thank you, Clyde. I cannot wait to share the good news. Hippocrates, after Kuka fell, Ultima came to me. I need to know what he is. Have you learned anything? Alas, no. And not for want of trying. I have scoured nigh every historical tome in our collection and found nothing. Not even the sort of conspicuous absence that might suggest a concealment of fact. One is almost tempted to conclude that such a creature never existed. But I saw him with my own eyes. I don't doubt that you did. Alas, it seems you are the only one who has. To others, he reveals naught. We see only that which he leaves in his wake. Like some terrible force of nature beyond the ken of mortal man. A bringer of death. Whether the Ultima you met with was the being itself, or merely another projection of its power, I know not. But until I do, my investigations shall continue. Thank you. It means a lot. Right. Let's see if Otto has anything else for me.
barely sat down since you came home. Vivian got you running air rhythms or something. Just spreading the word. So, the professor's got a soft side, has she? I'd never have guessed. No. She was right, though. Everyone was glad to hear the news. Ah, oh, but you ain't told everyone. I can think of plenty of friends back at the old hideaway who'd sleep more peacefully for knowing. Not least of all Sid. You should tell him. Hmm. You're right. I should. And I will. Well, when you do, be sure to take Mid with you. She's been going at it hammer and tongs down at that workshop of hers, trying to do her father proud. I can't remember the last time she visited the old salt's grave. Very well. I'll suggest it. Is Mid Sid's daughter? You know, that make a lot of sense. I just can't remember. I do remember a daughter comment from like Sid. I'm pretty sure, but I, you know. If I don't come up with something soon. All right, Clive. What do you want? Yep, daughter said. All right, I remember this. I remember the daughter comment like a way, way, way a bit of back, but uh, it it just kind of came back to me now. So, I'm going to visit Sid, and I thought you might like to come with me. Sorry, I'm too busy for all that right now. I've got to get this thermal displacement stack sorted. Thermal. <laughs> Displacement stack. Here. And uh, this is for... Only the fastest, finest ship the world has ever seen. The Enterprise. Me and my dad designed it together. Where other vessels rely on the fickle winds to drive them through the water, ours is fitted with mithril engines. And those things have got more push than a behemoth in a bad mood. And more heat than all the hells put together. Which is where the stack comes in. I may have already talked some tight-lipped shipwrights into putting the hull together for me in a little dockyard in Canva. But the stack's a bit more involved, so I'm building it here. Thing is, it's so involved that I'm running behind and it's starting to hold things up over at the shipyard. I'll come and see my dad, though, when I'm done. Whenever that is. <sighs> Is there anything I can do to help? Good old Clive. I was hoping you'd say that. First things first, I need some parts mechin. The sack will be made up of three major components. There's the plate in, here. That channels hot vapors away from the engine. The helm over the top, that disperses all that heat into the air. And the shield in around the sides. That stops the rest of the ship from going up in flames. Sheesh. A full suit of armor, then. Probably best to take it one piece at a time. Then you'll need to start with the plating. Everything else fits onto it. I've got the designs and the list of materials here. Show these to Blackthorn. He'll know what to do. I can't make it not tell of them. Luckily, you don't need to. Alrighty. Uh, we're teleporting. <laughs> we are teleporting. That's what we're doing. I'm not walking all that distance. Why is the bitrate problems gotta come back? It was doing so well the past day. 
We literally had like no frame drops last night. What happened? What happened? Now this. Blackthorn. Can I ask a favor? Out with it. It's for mid. This is my last chance to say I'm otherwise engaged. Spare myself for your sake. Go on then. What is it this time? She said you would know. Here. Krieger's Tate. Well, I don't know what the hell you'd want this for, but I can make it. Won't be easy, though. And I'll need help. Get Gavin Otto in here, will you? All right. So Mid's roped us all in here again, isn't she? Typical. Still, if that's what it takes to get her to visit Sid's grave, I'll do what I can. And, uh, what is it we need to do, exactly? Take a look at this. It's this plating. The usual saw grade still won't work. We need something that can get very hot, very fast, and still keep its shape. That means an alloy. Something that won't break or buckle at the temperature she's talking about. Which is where you lot come in. I need materials, and I've got my work cut out already. You'll have to fetch them. Now, there's a special kind of sand I'm after that you can only find out in the Valkroy. Stardust, they call it. As for the rest of the stuff, my usual supply should have it in stock. It just needs buying and bringing back here. Well, we'll get it done quicker if we split up. One of us should probably give you an hand coat in the sand. And the other can go and get the rest from this supplier. Right then. Well, make your minds up who's going where. We can Grow get up, Ahsoka. How you doing? I'm hungry. You going after the Stardust then, are you? Which one of these two lucky souls is going with you? Uh, Gav. Gav, you're with me. All right, then. So, uh, where do we find this stardust stuff? There's a river that runs through the southern reaches of the Velcroy. It's the black sand that washes Want up to just finish the game? After. About 50 hours southern in on your end? Jeez. The Velcroy, eh? You haven't finished the game yet? Past oh, shit. Shit. Well, I guess you could just I'll be doing all the other the side stuff and stuff. See about hiring us a wagon to bring the stuff back to. All right. I'll meet you by the river. I don't really know while how much time I put into the game. I'll pick up the rest of the stuff from Blackthorn's supplier. Take care. You two, eh? Don't go letting him fleece ya. Fleece me? I like to see him dry. <laughs> I've been doing hunts. I'm side. only doing side quests that like. I'm only doing side quests that unlock stuff on stream, but all this, like, all these green just isolation marks, I'm not doing on stream because they're not hard, but they just take a bit of time, and it's just, I'm just, every time I do them, I'm just like, I want to go play the story now. Uh, uh, I guess seven, 17, I mean. No, this is okay. That's not. It doesn't. That sh doesn't show playtime. Oh well. I think I'd say I'm uh, like 20 hours in. 20 hours, like 15, 20, 15 to 20, somewhere around that range. Before I do this, though, I'm gonna go look for some hunts. Also, I apologize. All right. Just like 
feel like it would be. Straight home now. Oh no, wait, is this the Okay, no, there we go. This is what we're looking for. Nice. Yeah, that is pretty sick. Whoa, okay, that's a new move. I guess you've got a B rank for nothing. Woo! I think I was just too close to the ship already. to do something cool to finish it. It won't work. Thirteen K, that's a lot. Oh cool, I can get the other bracelet now. Alright. The other one is the cattery. Which is oh my why is there so much I haven't explored here yet?
That's a lot of land to cover. Uh, the jaw. This is all here, by the way. Okay, the jaw's over here. Alright, on the A rank. My blade yet hungers, and so do I. Come. Let us feast on your flesh. Your feasting days are over. Whoa. Okay, you got it. You got it. Let's try. Jeez. It always it's like a freaking curveball. I always get confused by it. Taste of your own medicine, buddy. Gosh, I'm dead. Holy shit. Just got me in a combo and I could not get out. Alright, let's try again. Let's try again. Okay, that does not work. Gotcha. Doesn't work. I just said it doesn't work. Nice.
Wait, what did he just call me? That's a good boy. Nice. Jeez. I'm really liking that the, the hunt board is like a challenge. Like new movesets and everything. I think it's I think it's so fucking cool. Okay. Those who kill for sport deserve no better. True. Alright, let's go find the next one. Alright, so... Found out where the cattery is. We know where the one of the marks is. Trying to see if maybe the S rank that we have no idea, or it was just question marks, is out here. There's this giant open field I haven't gone to yet. Oh, it's cut off. Okay, maybe it isn't out here. Oh, never mind. Sheesh. Okay. Oh, fear back. Okay, I found a coral that I'm gonna fight, but I don't think that's the S rank. Yeah, no, it's just coral. No holding back. Safe. for real No, that was too fast. Ow.
I just want to find the S rank. Let's go. Faster. So maybe I wasn't supposed to. Maybe I'm not allowed. <laughs> What's that dog? It tried, the dog tried to kill me. Huh? From where? From where? Uh, I don't know. Give me a second. No mistakes. I'm going to actually stop this recording and then do the S ring separately. You deserve a rest. Oh, look at you, Mr. Commander. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, buddy. After what I've just been through, I don't think you're going to have a good time. Let's start it off with something basic. Let me introduce you to Anyways, you gonna come down here now? Oh no? Okay. Want me to deal with all of your all of your buddies? It's fine. Jeez. These guys are going to be more annoying than you because you keep sending them out. Oh, the parry. Good job. All right, you done hiding for me now? Yes, get down here. Whoa, okay, I guess that wasn't fast enough. 
Come here. my dog come on come on come here Cool. Dude, I'm rich. Look at how much freaking gill I have. I almost have 100k. That wasn't too bad, was it, Togo? Yep, that was that was fine actually. That was great. Uh, anyways, I need uh, I need potions. Where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? This way. The the most fragrant herbs. All I want to do is be able to run through the cities faster, man. Please. I'm begging you. Just allow me to do that, please. Nice. This one will probably be even easier than the last one. They don't look happy. Yeah, they don't. Well, bugs meet fire. That was cool, I guess. It wasn't really cool at all.
Yeah, that was very anticlimactic, honestly. That's probably the worst hunt I've done. Even the evil eye was way more interesting than that. But thanks for the gill. Alright. 